the time it was formed. They were regarded with veneration, and since the Christian era, they have been consecrated, blessed, and dedicated at a special presentation ceremony. The presentation ceremony you're about to witness contains... Her Majesty is accompanied on the inspection by the commanding officer, the host officer, and Her Majesty's equerry. to the nation is a milestone to be celebrated. This is the fourth time that I have presented the Royal Military College with a new colour. On each occasion, I have been most impressed with the discipline and determination of the college's graduates, many of whom have gone on to serve their nation with distinction on operations around the world, often in difficult and dangerous circumstances. Many have given their lives in defense of their country and their values. The presentation of colors is a special opportunity to recognize the past achievements, to give thanks for commitment and loyalty today, and to express confidence in the future. I entrust these colours to you today in the hope that you will guard and honour them through your conduct and example, upholding the values of leadership, duty and loyalty that are at the very core of your military training. I am confident that you will in turn pass them on with pride to your successors. The commanding officer will now respond on behalf of the cop.
The parade second in command will now hand over to the drill wing sergeant major, who will march the corps off the parade ground. Ladies and gentlemen, you are asked to remain seated until all troops of the band have left the parade ground. Oh! 